Naperville Central junior Brad Sanford is a left-hander with a knack for finding the net. In Saturday's 13-5 win over Fenwick in the boys' water polo state championship game, it didn't even matter which hand he used. He scored four goals against the Friars, capping off a 10-goal weekend. One of them was right-handed, a trick he also pulled on Stevenson in the quarter-finals. Another came with two seconds left in the first quarter of the title game as the Red Hawks built a 4-0 lead and never looked back, it's a good feeling. Sanford said of scoring right-handed. Being creative, especially in water polo, is such a huge advantage. I just had to come in confident. I just stayed confident and kept shooting. Sanford scored the final two goals of the first quarter for Naperville Central, 34-1. He then scored two more in the third quarter. The lead grew to as big as 12-3 by the fourth. This was probably one of Brad's best games. Red Hawks coach Bill Saladin said, He's had some great games all season long. He dropped off a little here and there, but he really stepped up, Saturday. He's one of the best lefties in the state, the trigger for Naperville Central's offense is usually junior goalkeeper Kent Emden, but he was fulfilling duties Saturday with the U.S. U national team. The Red Hawks found their offense in other ways. It turned out that success in man-up situations was a big key to the win. The first eight goals by Naperville Central came with the extra man. Rob Digger, Naperville's son Naperville Central's players hoist the state championship trophy on Saturday, May 19, 2018. Naperville Central's players hoist the state championship trophy on Saturday, May 19, 2018. Rob Digger, Naperville's son, the man up was huge. Sanford said, this season we kind of struggled with man-up, and we've been working on it in practice, finally against Stevenson it was good, and in the state championship game, it was even better, in the first quarter, both Central and Fenwick, 27-9, had four exclusions. The Red Hawks scored on all four of their chances. Fenwick went 0 for 4. They definitely deserve to be state champions, there's no doubt about it. Fenwick coach Kyle Perry said of the Red Hawks. They did what they wanted to do against us, it took some time for Naperville Central to get going Saturday morning in a 10-4 win against Conant in the state semifinals, but the offense kicked in after a scoreless first quarter. Central dominated the Cougars, leading 7-1 entering the fourth. Cam Doherty and Sanford each scored three goals for the Red Hawks. In the title game, Luke Klein Collins and Bander Russo each scored three times. Klein Collins' brother, Jonah, filled in for Emden in the net and made 10 saves. Obviously, Kent would have helped a lot, but Jonah did amazing this whole weekend and this whole season. Sanford said, It was unreal. He helped us a lot. Salatine recalled the first IHSA sponsored state tournament in 2002. The Red Hawks fell behind Fenwick 20-0 in the quarterfinals before losing 24-6, this time, Naperville Central beat the Friars for the title. It was Red Hawks' second state title in three years, we've worked hard over the last few years, Saladin said. We stayed together and worked together in the offseason. They made a commitment to each other. It's special. We've come a long way. Paul Johnson is a freelance reporter for the Naperville Sun.